when the spark of the war between Israel and Gaza fire we saw Israel allies came out to the world and said it out loud clearly we're gonna stand in the side of Israel and support Israel to the last breath we're gonna give Israel whatever they need to defend itself and its citizen and on top of these allies the United States of America Biden Joe Biden said it out clear on CNN TV international TV he said this he said we're gonna stand in the side of Israel we're gonna make sure that we give Israel whatever they need to defend themselves and their citizens from now on we're going to send our troops on whatever they need they said it out loud clearly the other allies were very close waiting for them to rise up a finger they will come running fighting Gaza on our brothers and sisters and at the same time Muslims around the world the Arab behind the screen behind the TV screens were saying we condemn what happened to Palestine we condemn what happened to Gaza we condemn we condemn a lot of paper written outside in the world telling people please stop it please stop you know it seems to me uh, it, it, it seems to be like a lion with its prey and the hyenas walking around to get something hyenas walking around the lion and the lion eating its prey so the hyenas are the Arab leaders but at the same time I have to thank and give my, my, my deep respect and love to Yemenis. The Yemenis stand tall and set it out clear too. And they said, we're going to support Gaza vehemently with our troops, with our guns, whatever we have, we're going to put it there. We will die in Gaza, defending, supporting our brothers and sisters to the last breath. We, I thank, I myself thank Yemenis. You guys, thank you very much for the brave, the brave and the strong words you said to the world. You guys, you're not waiting. You will never stay coughing your hands and looking to the world, looking at the world. You just want to share it and die with your brothers and sisters. Um, I, I know a lot of people, they